Adam, you have received a package. Thanks, Entity. I was waiting for that. Today I have to review the factory floor modernization plans for smart use. Entity, can you get me access to the business case for smart shoes, please? As you wish. Access and credentials complete. Mmm, interesting. The team uses the latest in programmable sensor technology that employs wide-range communication spectrums. You know, I can remember when NFC and Bluetooth were the only medium to transfer data between devices. Things have changed a lot, Adam. Now, the Internet of Things is beyond connectivity. It has become a key enabler of differentiation in the experience economy, as well as for business process simplification. Look, there are seven layers in the reference model. Devices send and receive data, interacting with the connectivity network, where the data is normalized and filtered using edge computing just before landing in data storage and databases accessible by applications. These applications process and provide actionable insight for people and machines that will act and collaborate. So, our current IT estate needs to evolve incrementally. It would be useful for me to see how the product and manufacturing process works. Is that possible? Yes, it is. Yes. Oh, now this is clever. Look, Entity, they use the same programmable sensor technologies in the manufacturing process as those that will be in the final product. Adam. Let me introduce you to the product manager of this factory. Hello. Congratulations, this is very impressive. Thank you, Adam. As you can see, our manufacturing process is a repeatable, unpredictable sequence. However, our current IT systems cannot handle the flood of real-time sensor and controller events. In the smart era, all devices are intelligent. Even the components of these very devices have a refined sensor system, which regularly measures their condition. And what's more, the potential of sensor technology in our next generation shoes is even greater. They measure your biometric state and cross-reference this with where you run and how you did it. That is brilliant. Thank you so much. This was very educational. Entity, we've got work to do. I need to enable this kind of business process simplification in my daily activity. Perfect, Adam. Let's do it. The Internet of Things is a data channel which, as we can see in the forecast regarding growth, the number of devices is going to flood us with information. Today, Internet of Things is transforming not only the way we do business, but also how we go about our daily lives. In the smart era, all devices are intelligent. The main challenge uh, is to create business values for customers. And uh, unfortunately, there are, there are not so um, good, good use cases uh, in the IoT field. There is an IoT World Forum which has really identified seven layers. These seven layers are really basically focused on uh, identifying what the devices are and how to connect these devices together and create what, we, what is commonly called a computing edge and where data can be accumulated and abstracted for applications and analytics to collaborate with people, with places, and with things. You know, I can remember when NFC and Bluetooth were the only medium to transfer data between devices. In the future, uh, by higher performance of uh, computing and uh, first uh, network capabilities, 
uh, we can make a more sophisticated IoT world. To do this, we need cloud or on-premise architectures which are capable of supporting this intake of data, big data and analytics, and modern user interfaces which enable efficient interaction with the system for operating or decision-making and even artificial intelligence. So we can take advantage of the lower cost and high volume platforms, create a central compute system, create edge devices that are taking massive amounts of data and storing those on the edge and only uploading to the ECU the anomalies rather than all the data. And then obviously because of the collection challenges with massive amounts of data that are occurring through all those sensors, we'll download those as we pull into a station. NTT Data looks forward to all the ways IoT will continue to drive industry into the future. And we are excited to be part of creating that reality and helping our customers experience it too. NTT, we've got work to do. We at NTT are really accelerating digital with our clients. And it's really that acceleration is really through the intersections and the combinations of those digital focus areas correlated against the industry. Thank you.